Yep, he's back under the bus again. At uh, least he's sitting up this time. Right. So, this is the air dryer, but it's an older style air dryer, unfortunately. And what does that mean? That means you have to really take it apart. The newer ones actually have a filter that screws on, not unlike an, uh, like an oil filter. This one here is not that. has to be disassembled and it had like eight bolts in it that are all stacked right here just to get to the filter and out there on the chair right next to you uh -huh. is the filter we're replacing that would be this okay. so here is the the housing for it Oh. Notice how full oil it is? I'll show that again. There shouldn't be oil in here. Oh. That suggests that the uh, filter's bad. So, look at, I mean, look at that. It's my fingers. It's oily. Oh my gosh, it's really bad. Yeah. There's never supposed to be oil in there? I don't think so. Wow. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this off <sighs> without his little filter strap thing that he took to Tennessee. Oh, he already took it? I think so. I have a chain one. Where in storage? What did that guy use that one day? Remember? We were watching him and he used a strap. And twisted a stick in it or something? Or Yeah. All right, go get me one of the straps on the back of the Jeep. Okay. I'm trying to remember how this guy did this. I wonder if I can just do something a little bit different. Hey, give me that breaker bar that's in the box. Mm-hmm. Thanks. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's warm. Right? It's hot. <clears throat> Man, that's tight. Oh, come on. I might have to get my little chain release. All right, we got it. Oh, you got it? Yeah. Oh, I missed it. I just used this thing. It's kind of like a pipe wrench, only really adjustable. But just because it tightens up on there and then you can turn it? Yeah. I didn't think I could get it at first. It wasn't budging, but then it just popped. Oh, good. So that was, that was happy to see that. Okay. Out with the old? You need the new one yet, or do you have to? Well, give me that. Uh, I need some paper towels and the brake cleaner over there. Okay. This thing's filthy. Wow. Um, small screwdriver or any screwdriver, actually. Thanks. Uh huh. Okay. So there's a couple O-rings. The new one came with some. You got any more paper towels? Okay, well, this thing is just super filled with all sorts of goo and gunk. Oh, I saw stuff running over and dripping off the edge. That was all the stuff oh, I right sprayed here. in here, yeah. It's heavier than it looks like it's going to be. It seems like it's as heavy as the other one, huh? First, do this, then we do this. Ow. Like that. Luckily, I found my 916 inch wrench. Fortunately. It was right in front of your face the whole time. Fortunately, it was. 
I'm going to tighten this all the way down. If I want everything to line up again, like you just want to get them in place. Because if I tighten that, I would not have been able to get that in because it could be twisted slightly. Oh, God. Sharp rock under my bootay. <laughs> oh, for an air ratchet right now. I really wanted to sew today and get a couple more curtains made, but it has been even more windy than usual today. And I just came out here and saw what happened to the sewing machine. I don't know if you can see this, but the thread is blowing out here. And then I noticed that there's thread all over the chair. And then I noticed that the threads are trailing out everywhere <laughs> behind the chair. And then I noticed the thread all over the ground. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. This is like half of that spool of thread. It is everywhere, like a giant spider web all over the whole yard. It's even over here. It's like in every direction. It's ridiculous. I don't think we'll be putting that thread back on the spool. <laughs> now he's on the other side of the bus. This guy gets around. Okay, what's going on under here now? This is the last thing. Are you sure? Let's see the camera. I'm not convinced. You see that thing right there? It's been leaking air and to the point I had to actually tighten this little uh, thing here all the way down and it stopped air from coming out of it. But its sole purpose in life is to, they call this the wet tank and that's the main air tank. This is like I know they all look the same size, but when air is made by the bus, the first place it goes is here. Then it leaves and goes through things called check valves, which only allow air to go one way. So they only can go out to the front air brakes and the rear air brakes. That way, if one of the brake systems fails, then the other air brake system won't be affected by that loss of air, but you'll get warnings telling you you should probably stop. So this is what we're doing right now is this thing right here when you reach the unloading pressure and that's when the bus goes um, this one also does it so there's one at the air dryer does it and it sends a little signal to this one to do it too well this one's all eat up probably because there was so much oil in the system so now we're changing this one out and I'm gonna replace it with da, 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 brand new one looks exactly the same it's called an expello made by a company called Expello. So that's what we're gonna do right now. I think in the box is some uh, Teflon tape over there, is there? So the pressure's actually going up faster than it used to, which would suggest our compressor wasn't working as efficiently as it could. So as soon as it gets up 60, it'll stop making ding dong noises. And then we need to get it up to the unloading pressures and make sure everything unloads. And uh, if it does, we win. Hooray! Lately, Mama Sita has been turning up missing. Time and time again, I go looking through the bus and I can't find her anywhere, and I assume she must be outside. But now, I've just found her hiding place. She's sleeping in the bottom of the shower. <laughs> She's our little catfish. <laughs> Melta. 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 The male's here. Come on, Bye guys. Mail time!
time. Mail time once again. Mail time, everybody. This one's a pretty big one. It's Gigantor. Who's this, this from? This is from Car Carol and Frank Butcher. Just like you're supposed to on Christmas morning. You always read the card first. The suspense is killing me. <laughs> to Mike and Carrie, thank you for sharing your adventure with us. Watching your channel provides us with joy, humor, drama, education. Mike Guyver. We look to do this someday soon. Uh. Carrie, wrapped in the cloth is a little something for your new grandbaby. Mike, the majority of yours should be under the paper with the enjoy label. P.S. Mama Kitties is coming and forgot to pack. <laughs> it's uh -huh. actually in the car. Oh, I yeah. think I know Mama, what that is. Mama Kitties was separate, huh? Yes. That's clever. Oh, very clever. Oh, they're poofy. They tied them up and made little air. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's heavy. It's actually a treasure chest. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. For treasures. It's literally a treasure chest. Aww. <laughs> <Ready>? <laughs> <laughs> they were totally listening. Dry erase markers. <laughs> Very good. Totally. Actually, we, we, thank you. We will definitely be using. Oh, oh my gosh, this is a box of treasures. Oh. There's a whole bunch of jewelry in here, like earrings. That's probably and... the one she said you crafted. Oh yeah, this must be what she makes. Your shows gave me the idea for your bracelet. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, oh, that's lovely. Look, there's little turtles on the bracelet. Isn't that so cute? <laughs> Ready? Oh! So cute. Look at that. Our little school bus. Handmade little guy. It's bussy. It's got wheels to even turn on it. <laughs> awesome. That's going on our dash. Going for on the sure. dash. <laughs> well, we know who this is for. Oh, that would be me. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly, this is like a pound of chocolate. <laughs> right. Oh, look at this. This must be for you. Oh, These are real it? whiskey glasses. Oh, look, they're the kind that... Oh, that's unique. Yeah, and they have the like the quintessential like angle for sniffing. Oh, that's the proper shape yes. for, for proper whiskey enjoyment. Super cool. Wait, Thank here, you. Here, put it more flat on my hand so you can see. Like that. That's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, these are cool. I've seen these before. I like these. Thank you so much. These are really cool. Yeah, that is cool. Oh, oh, you know what these are? No. You don't know what these are, but I do. These you put down in whiskey to help... Uh, to add more flavor to whiskey. You can Shut darken them. Shut up. You actually this like know the, what it is. This is like the wood charring stuff for, there's, these are cool. There's no way I would have known this. Yeah, these are these are like charred pieces of white oak and you put them down, if you're like a moonshiner, <laughs> you'd put these down into your clear moonshine and this would impart the oakiness and the color that you would get in whiskey. And so that's what this is, and these are really cool. And I was gonna oh, buy yeah. some of these, so it's really cool that you actually sent this. That's super neat. So if you are a purist whiskey drinker, you freeze these. Oh, so you and don't then put water. So in you'll your put whiskey? water so you can keep it neat all the way to the end of your drink. Uh -huh. But cold and neat. <laughs> there you go. He's got a set of steel balls. Well, I had them <laughs> before they got here. What is this? Hmm. This is fancy. This is, wait, hold it up and show I'm it to like figure this. Out where it is. Fancy I want to say these are set, for, right? Uh, putting those also into the glass. I think that's what that is. Your little tongs. Whiskey stones. Yeah. So you put these in the same as in this. In the freezer. You put them in the freezer and then you put them in to keep it neat. Uh -huh. Awesome. There's more. Holy cow! This is the gift that never ends. Oh, look! Look at this. Is that another whiskey thing? Yeah. You put your whiskey in this. To, and then you could put these things, those little, uh, these smoke things, right down inside to oh. age it. Thank you guys so much. What a fantastic gift this is. I don't know if we'll be able to uh, 
keep this uh, box because it's so big. But it's what a thoughtful way to send this to us. I know. <laughs> I really, it's, it was so cool. We just have limited room on the bus, so. Um, but this is cool, and this is stuff that I will use. And I know Carrie, the stuff Carrie got, I'm sure she will. We should use give as well. the box to Atreus as a a, oh, yeah. to a toy chest. To that's what they think that we're talking about. Is that what they were yeah. meaning? Very good toy chest. Yeah. Actually, I think they were talking about that too. But forget it. He doesn't get our cool yeah, bus. The bus is going on the dash. Bus going on the dash. It's super cute. He wouldn't like it. <laughs> he wouldn't appreciate it like we do. <laughs> <laughs> but he's getting a cool toy chest. Dude, awesome. Wow, what a cool gift. Thank you, guys. Yeah, thank oh, you look. so much. Oh, look, look, look. Oh, there's something else. This is the, uh... The thing about those glasses. Mm-hmm. And also about uh, aging it with these, uh, these little things here. Tweak your best booze by adding two new ingredients, oak and patience. I don't got any patience. That's for sure. How unfortunate. <laughs> He's <laughs> Mr. Instant Gratification. <laughs> Awesome. Thank you guys so much. That's really cool. This gift was really neat. Yeah, thank Over the you. top. Thank you very For sure. much. sure. Really nice. Really nice. Mama Kitty, come on up. Come up this ladder. Come on up here. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you Come she on. climbs the ladder just like a person. <laughs> Come here, Mama. She's hilarious. I can't believe you caught that. <laughs> I know. I can't believe she did it while I was filming. <laughs> Goofy cat. Oh, Mama. You're See ridiculous. Down. Come here. Oh. oh, kitty Mama. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright Right. With you and I, the future is bright. 